Stones and Giants. Rock and Talk while reading a book together. The people in this book are brave, said Talk. They fight dragons and giants, and they are never afraid. I wonder if we are brave, said Rock. Rock and Todd looked into a mirror. We look brave, said Rock. Yes. But are we? asked Todd. Rock and Todd went outside. We can try to climb this mountain, said Rock. That should tell us if we are brave. Rock went leaping over rocks, and Todd came puffing up behind him. They came to a dark cave. A big snake came out of the cave. A r o d e n g e said the snake. When he saw Rock and Todd, he opened his wide mouth. Rock and Todd jumped away. Todd was shaking. I'm not afraid, he cried. They climbed higher and they had a loud noise. Many large stones were rolling down the mountain. It's an avalanche, cried Todd. Rock and Todd jumped away. Rock was trembling. I am not afraid, he shouted. They came to the top of the mountain. The shadow of a hawk fell over them. Frog and Todd jumped under a rock. The hawk flew away. We, we are not afraid, screamed Frog and Todd. At the same time, then they ran down the mountain very fast. They ran past the place where they saw the avalanche. They ran past the place where they saw the snake. They ran all the way to Todd's house. No, I am glad to have a brave friend like you, said t o d He jumped into the bed and put the t a b e t over his head. And I am happy to know a brave person like you, t o d said t o d He jumped into the closet and shut the door. Todd stayed in the bed, and Frog stayed in the closet. They stayed there for a long time, just feeling very brave together.